Experts at Oregon State University say all Oregonians have a stake in forest management. They add we have to learn to live with wildfires. Emma Jerome joins us live this morning with a sobering warning from experts. Emma? Good morning, Emily. After speaking with those experts from Oregon State University, it's clear to me that we need to start thinking of fires as inevitable, like we think of earthquakes and tsunamis. We can't control that they will happen. What we can control is how we decide to deal with them after the fact. James Johnston is a research associate at Oregon State University for the College of Forestry. He says as a society, we've made the decision to exclude fire from forests that are designed to burn, which has allowed a lot of fuel to accumulate. And we as a society have decided to enrich the atmosphere with CO2, which has locked us into a hotter and drier future. He says we've locked ourselves into this future by decisions we've made. We've made the decision to have forest fires and we can't take that decision back. Now our challenge is to learn to live with fires. He says we live in a part of the country meant to burn. The difference is the severity. Decisions we make now are whether or not to manage the forests to reduce density and remove surface fuels with prescribed burns. Johnston also says that it might take a lot of legislature to get us to in, be in a better spot about dealing with fires and protecting us moving forward. But there already has been legislature that has passed. In the next half hour, we are talking about Senate Bill 762, which is the first step to helping ourselves. Reporting live in Portland this morning, Emma Jerome, Coin 6 News.